Hey bees, I have some wonderful news. Elaine from Jet Pens provided me stationery. If you've never heard of them, I'll give the link in the description below or click right here. Uh, they are a wonderful company that provides pens, pencils, I mean, all sorts of awesome Japanese stationery. So, I'll be reviewing the stationery that they gave me and I'll be looking to write on notebooks and see how they write. Let's go ahead and do that. So this is the packaging that I came with and there's usually bubble wrap inside. And so I got these pens and pencil. So this one is the friction pen. This is a Zebra Espina Pearly Rubber and this is the Zebra Expands Ballpoint Pen. So I went ahead and wrote high and you would basically need to press this down in order to write. And at the end there's this friction rubber ending so that you would be able to erase. And so I've actually have known about these friction pens for uh, many years. Uh, I actually got, let's see, my coworkers and my boyfriend a bunch of these friction pens. Before they came with uh, like a little cap that you could pop off. I personally didn't like them uh, because you would always have to take off the cap in order to uh, use the rubber eraser. And so I looked at jet pens and they had these Japanese version of it. Uh, so, which, which looked exactly like this. Uh, without the flames. So the Japanese casing doesn't have the flames while the US does. So what I like about these is that uh, some people they use it for sewing because if you want to make a mark on fabric for example you can sew and then use an iron to heat, heat up the fabric and then the ink will go away. But one problem with this type of ink is that you need to keep the notebook at a cool place. So I remember talking with my boyfriend and he said that he had some trouble when his notebook was left inside his really hot car. And so uh, I read online that if you put it in a freezer for about, I don't know, maybe like 30 minutes, the ink will appear again and it will stay like that after you put it in the freezer. So if there are any heat exposure, then put it in the freezer and you're good. Okay, so. We move on to this Zebra Espina Pearly Rubber and they come in all different kinds of colors, orange, this minty green, blue and black. And I've never really seen this before. And the coolest part is that the entire casing except this top part is rubber. And it feels really nice on your hand. And let's see. This is a 0.5 pencil. And I will definitely buy more of these. I, it's, it feels really nice because usually you would see pencils that have rubber near the tip and then the rest is plastic, but this entire pencil is rubber. Then we go with this Zebra Expand Ballpoint Pen. So this is a 0.7. 
And what it does, it you expand it and the tip comes out. So this is um, a, re a little bit heavier than this pen because this is uh, all plastic. And when you write, it's with just like all ballpoint pens, it's very smooth. And so this is really good if you want to keep it in your bag or put it in your pocket because it's small enough. Let's see. Almost the size of this notebook. And this notebook is the Baron Fig notebook that I've reviewed. If you want to look at that, go ahead and click right here or I'll put the link in the description below. And uh, these pens were lightly used. So for example, this would have a cap on the top. This is fine. While this, um, after I would write uh, more, the ink will dis uh, wouldn't write as easily. So I wouldn't discourage you from getting this pen because I believe what would happen is that there would be some kind of plastic covering on the tip of um, this tip and <laughs> obviously not this tip but uh, of the pens. Uh, there would be some plastic covering so that it shows that people haven't used it at their company. And so I really, really encourage you to definitely get this pencil if you like the fact that it's all rubber for the casing. I would also encourage you to get this pen if you want an on-the-go pen. And I would encourage you to get this pen because if you're into sewing or if you like the fact that you can erase your mistakes, definitely get this. Thank you so much Jet Pens. I really appreciate you supporting bloggers and YouTubers and I hope that you guys, you bees, would get these products and I definitely would buy more of these pets. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and I will see you next